Alright, so continuing on in this Felicia Hardy series where we're going to be doing this quest to flight Felicia, we're going to come in here and fight her. Oh, this woman is crazy. Oh, I like webbing people. Alright, this stage is a bit, this portion's a bit crazy. She, um, you'll never be able to spot her, let's just say that. Unless you're up in the air. So what you need to do is climb up here, and then give her the surprise attack. Oh, something is shooting at me. Special delivery. <laughs> Stand still. Can't touch this. Whoa. Alright, this hide and seek thing is back to a point where we have to go in the air. Alright. So she is somewhere. She's hiding behind one of these stops. Right there. Where did you go? To get this kind of power? Huh. It's not the power you should be concerned about. It's the responsibility it gave me. You know, to beat the living crap out of criminals like you. Oh, I'll bet you say that to all the girls. Only the ones I really like. To see behind bars. A spider first, then a lizard. Maybe I could be part of your little animal kingdom. Tell me how. Um, nope. I'll find it without you, you know. So long, spider. <laughs> Uh-uh, not so fast, Felicia. When you get out of prison, you should think about changing careers. But, uh, keep the costume. You don't need to carry me. I have feet. Two of them. Well, you can use them to get into the police car in a couple minutes. Then, I'm thinking, what, maybe, uh, walk the grounds of Beloit again? Probably. Though, I really don't belong there, you know. Yeah, right. That's what they all say, isn't it? I may be a criminal spider, but I'm not crazy. I've just made some enemies, that's all. Powerful enemies. What? Like Norman Osborne? Something like that. Ever wonder what it's like to live every day as the only female in the midst of some of the most dangerous dudes you'll ever meet? All while looking... how I look. You think that's allowed to happen without some kind of special arrangement by someone in power? Can't say that I've ever wondered about any of that, but I will say... You almost got me feeling sorry for you there. Not my intention. To be honest, 
I was just hoping you'd fess up on which floor of the Oscorp Tower holds that stuff that made you able to do whatever a spider can. What? I never mentioned Oscorp. How did you... The Osborne comment gave it away. I'm kind of smart like that. <laughs> You're something else, Felicia. You know that? Yep, I do. Here's my stuff. Here's the girl you were looking for. Go easy with the handcuffs. Wouldn't want her to break a nail. And Felicia, don't go counting on me to break you out this time. Oh, I wouldn't worry about that, Spider. I wouldn't worry about that at all. You know, let's be honest. I mean, since we have a couple of minutes here, um, that was quite strange. Felicia only got her powers after he met. She met her father, according to the AMA series, and then allowed her to become the Black Cat. I mean, other than that, Felicia is uh, generally a normal girl. That you know, she isn't into karate or kung fu fighting or anything, according to the animated series. But I'm not really sure why they made Felicia like that. I mean, I like Felicia as a good person. <laughs> Personally, because Black Cat is one of the best uh, female characters in Spider-Man. So, we've done that. That was just a sort of an objective we needed to complete. Anyway, so, that was the Felicia Hardy kind of quest. We'll continue on the Spider-Man story in the next video.